the youth at 10.30. Uh, at noon, the junior competition, 1.30, the senior competition, then 3 o'clock, the open competition. Uh, as all of you who are here today know, admission uh, to the contest this afternoon is free. It's also free tomorrow. Uh, if you're planning on coming to the evening concert tonight, which features Dan Levinson and the Up Jumpers, uh, we ask uh, that you clear out the auditorium uh, after the concert. And if you have not already, you can purchase a ticket uh, at the door this evening. Or if you're going to visit the craft grounds uh, later today, you can get a ticket for the evening show tonight. So just a reminder, we're glad to have you here today. Uh, it's free admission both today and tomorrow for the contest. If you're going to be in for the concerts tonight or tomorrow, that is a $12 ticket to charge. I see Judy Kent walking uh, down the hall here. Uh, I want to say this is such a cliche, uh, but events like this don't go on without a lot of volunteer help. Uh, and without the work of a lot of different folks. I certainly couldn't put this on by myself. So we're bringing to the stage now uh, Judy Kent. Uh, she's involved with Ozark Old Time Tradition. She's going to make a few remarks to you about the contest today and a few other things. So please, a nice round of applause for Ms. Judy Kent. Thank you, dear. This is the fourth year that we've had the Old Time Traditional Fiddle Contest on Friday. And we think this year is probably going to be the best yet. We have many fiddlers who have contacted us to say we're on our way, we'll be there, we want to play in this old time contest. So we're just really pleased with the way that we have revived the traditional old time fiddling. And thank you for coming today to hear these fine fiddlers. We've added a, um, an audience favorites drawing today. I've spoken to many about this, I've sold many of you tickets, thank you for that already. At the end of each round, if you want to participate, this row of cups on that table is where you can drop a ticket for your favorite contestant in that round. After the, the tickets have been put into the cups, the contestant with the winning number of tickets wins half of that amount that's in the cup. The other half, we will draw one ticket out, and whichever audience member bought that ticket will win the other half of the pot. It could be $2, it could be $20, who knows? I hope that you'll participate with that. Any other tickets that are dropped in the cups, proceeds will go to Old Time Ozark Traditions, which is a 501c3 nonprofit whose purpose is to keep alive the old time music and dance in this area. So we really appreciate your being here. A couple of housekeeping items. While the contestants are playing, please don't talk and please don't walk around. It's, it's really hard enough, especially for these children, to be playing on this big stage, and they don't need any distractions, so we really appreciate that. Thank you so much for being here today. Thank you, Judy. Uh, we should also mention tonight, uh, as part of the evening concert, uh, I know Judy would want us to mention this, we'll be giving away the Jay Mulkey Ken Award that recognizes excellence uh, in old time fiddling. That will be part of our evening concert tonight. So if you're planning on being here, uh, we'll be Judy uh, and her husband, uh, Wes Kent, will be presenting the Jay Monkey Kent Award later tonight. So with that, that's a bit of housekeeping notes. As Judy said, we're going to make a few uh, last minute adjustments with the lights and a couple other things, and we'll start the competition as close to 1030 as possible. So make yourselves comfortable. Hope you enjoy the day. start this round of competition in the 2016 Arkansas State Fiddle Championship Old Time Division. We're glad you're all here again. We're going to get things started off, of course, with contestant one. The first song, a breakdown, is called Step Around Johnny. Tune number two, the waltz, peekaboo waltz, and the tune of choice is called Bob Here Mule. So please, a nice round of applause for contestant number one.
Render. Uh, once again, Old Time Ozark Traditions is sponsoring uh, this contest uh, today as far as prize money goes. Uh, the youth division prizes today uh, are $100 for first place, second place gets $50, and third place is $25. Also, our first place contestant gets a lovely plate, which you might think, well, what's the big deal about a plate? Well, it's a special plate that was done here in the Craft Village by Perry Munn Pottery. Uh, they're wonderful, handmade, one-off plates, and on the plate it says, these are for the first place winners. So it's a real neat treat. So when the first place winners go home, they've got a plate, they can use it as a display, or when they're eating dinner, and they get through with their mashed potatoes, it'll say right underneath there, and they can remind everybody, you know, I won first place, by the way. So that's a great thing. So thanks to Old Time Ozark Traditions and Perry Munn Pottery for their work on that. With that, we're ready to bring out contestant we'll be hearing are, the breakdown is entitled Bill Cheatham, the second tune, The Waltz, is called Country Waltz, and the tune of choice we'll be hearing is Billy and the Low Ground. So please, a nice round of applause for contestant number two.
A reminder, we have five contestants uh, in the youth uh, competition in this round, and once we've completed, uh, all of them have completed their performances, the judges will be tallying up the scores, and we'll be bringing all the contestants back up on stage, and we'll be awarding the prizes uh, immediately following each round uh, of the competition. So, those of you who have competed, or you have a son or daughter who's competed, make sure once the competition this round has ended, uh, they're backstage. We'll bring all the all the kiddos back up on stage, and we'll hand out the awards. Okay, up next. Yep, you guessed it. It's contestant number three. The following songs will be played. The breakdown is Leather Bridges. The waltz is called Clark's Waltz, and the tune of choice is Carroll County Blues. So please now a nice round of applause for contestant number three.
following tunes. The breakdown is Step Down, Ho Down, The Waltz, Peekaboo Waltz, and the tune of choice, song number three, is Dill Pickle Rag. Please, a nice round of applause for contestant number four.
All right, well, the judges are doing what we're paying them to do today, and that is make a difficult decision of scoring. So they'll be back there doing that, and also I see Ms. Judy Ken has made it to the stage. Ms. Ken. Thank you, Derek. Wow, what a great start. I want, some of you didn't get to uh, hear what we announced at the beginning. This year we've added an audience favorites voting. You'll see the cups that are on the table in the center of the auditorium. If you would like to purchase tickets to vote for your favorite contestant, they're a dollar a piece. We got all our five contestants in the youth division. Y'all come on out. There they are, give them a big hand. Our third place winner, which gets a certificate and a check for $25 is Riley Morrow. Yes, you can stand right there, Riley. Uh, our second place winner and a check for $50, Corey Williams. Our first place winner, a uh, check for $100 and a lovely plate from Perry Mon Pottery. Our first place winner this year, Elijah Reeves. So, there they are, our winners. Big hand for all of our contestants. Lori, I believe, will be out to take some photos. And uh, we'll be back with you right at noon. Oh, got the fiddle. You. We'll be back with you uh, right around noon uh, for the next division. Thanks, y'all. Within the last uh, hour or so, welcome. We're glad to have you today. Uh, for those folks who have recently entered, just a reminder, of course, admission today is free. We're glad to have you here. Uh, that's a great cost for you, free. Uh, please remember, once the competition is over uh, this afternoon around 4 o'clock, we'll empty the theater out, and if you're interested in coming back to the show tonight, uh, which feature in between uh, our divisions and our competitions, but uh, one of our judges, Drew Beiswinger, uh, he works in, at the Arkansas, at, uh, rather in the Special Collections, University of Arkansas Library in Fayetteville. He's written a book called Ozark's Fiddle Music, and he's here as a judge. It's been a few years since he's returned back, so we're glad to have Drew Beiswinger with us. Very pleasant gentleman, I enjoy talking to him. Uh, also one of our judges, a past winner, uh, is Miss Emily Phillips. She really needs no introduction. Other than that, she's a great fiddler, and we're glad to have her here. And our third and final judge, a uh, gentleman by the name of Dan Levinson. He's here with his musical partner, Andy Trimble, and they'll be playing tonight. Dan Levinson has a number of books, videos, CDs, and all sorts of things when it comes to old-time fiddle. He'll be performing tonight. We'll have a lot of his wares for sale, so we encourage you to come to the show tonight, visit with Dan after the show, check out what he's got. So thanks to Dan Levinson for coming and the show. Okay, with that, we are ready to start the junior competition. This is for kids the age of 12 to 16. And the prizes in this division are first place $200, second place $100, and third place, $50. With that, I see contestant number one making their way to the stage. We'll be hearing the following songs. The breakdown is Old Joe Clark, The Waltz, Roxanna Waltz, and the tune of choice, Angeline the Baker. Please a nice round of applause for contestant number one.
Taylor. Number two song, The Waltz, is called Sunday River Waltz. And number three, the tune of choice, is entitled Lumberjack. Please a nice round of applause for contestant number two. Kiss Me Waltz, 
and the tune of choice, the third and final tune, Bonaparte Crossing the Rhine. So please, a nice round of applause for contestant number three.
following songs. First tune, the breakdown, is called Blue Mule. The waltz, song number two, Evening Star Waltz. And the tune of choice, tune number three, is entitled White River. If you would please, a nice round of applause for contestant number four.
number one. The tunes we'll be hearing are Billy in the Low Ground and Westphalia Waltz. Once again, a round of applause for contestant number one.
Casey Williams. Uh, I will say our first and second place winners were separated by one point. That is the narrowest margin possible in that our second place winner, $100, Rebecca Poole. Okay, uh, I didn't bring the plate out, but it's right back there, and I'm sorry. Uh, our first place winner, by one point, a check for $200, and the plate, which will come shortly, is Kaylee Speaks. Uh, all y'all come on up one more time, and Lori's going to get a photo. Uh, we'll be drawing for the senior division if we haven't already. Uh, that round will start at 1.30. Great round of applause for these fine contestants. $100, third place $100, and once again, first place gets a wonderful commemorative plate uh, from the Perry Mon Pottery. So, we're going to get started in just a moment. Don't forget about our...
songs from contestant number three, The Breakdown, is Durang's Hornpipe. Song number two, The Waltz, Rock All My Babies to Sleep. And the tune of choice, tune three, is entitled Whistling Rufus. Please, a nice round of applause for contestant number three.
hearing the following songs. The Breakdown is entitled Hillbilly Hoedown, The Waltz, Ozark Moon, and the Tune of Choice, Dixie Blossoms. Please welcome contestant number five.
six, yes, a nice round of applause. Contestant number six making their way to the stage will be hearing the following song. Number one, the breakdown. It's called Bob Tailed Mule, the waltz, good night waltz, and the tune of choice is Waynesboro. Please make welcome contestant number six.
Adams. Number two, the waltz is the Irma waltz. And the tune of choice, tune number three, is entitled White River. A nice round of applause for contestant number seven.
Tune number two, The Waltz, is called Rosebud of Avonmore. And the tune of choice, Caledonian March. Please welcome contestant number eight. Thank you. 
third place winner is Gary Johnson. Second place winner, a uh, cash prize in the form of a check of $300, goes to Dave Smith. Yeah. All right, first place, this wonderful Perry Mon plate, uh, which says, first place, old time senior on it. And a check for $500 goes to Henry the Fiddler. Senior division, thanks once again to each and every one of you. Our open round starts at 3 o'clock. Yes, 3 o'clock. Uh, that's right, so we've got a few minutes. Uh, hey, baby. She's not like a moving picture. Like, little moving picture. She's like rolling. rolling. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that now. Now back up. Lord, I'm blessing y'all, Lord. Well, they all I can talk to. We think you're a blessing. They all bless you. You got that. Have that. Have that. Have that. That's wonderful. That's perfect. Okay. No, 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 no. Listen. Listen, let's play it. Tell us your balls. Made in love. Made in love. Bob it's, Will. It sounds like Tennessee Bull. Take my contest. Come and watch all day. We're so happy everybody came. Hope to see many of you back here tomorrow. A reminder, uh, if you're coming to the show tonight, we hope to see you. And if you don't have a ticket, it is paid admission. If you were an accompanist or a participant in the contest today and you have a name badge, of course you're welcome to come in tonight. No ticket required. With that, we're ready to get started. We have seven contestants in the open round. Contestant one has made their way to the stage. We'll be hearing the following tunes. The breakdown is called North Carolina Breakdown. The waltz, Grover Jones's waltz. And the tune of choice, Gilsaw. Please, a nice round of applause for contestant number one.
David Holt and Josh Goforth. If you haven't seen a David Holt performance, it's truly spectacular. That's going to be Friday the 2nd, I believe. On Saturday the 3rd, we've got, also got a wonderful lineup. Again, the Jones Family Band will be here. They'll be joined. Up next is contestant number two. We'll be hearing the following tunes. The Breakdown, Polk County Breakdown, The Waltz, Ozark Waltz, and the tune of choice, Bear Creek Hop. Please, a nice round of applause for contestant number two.
here for a master class and also a performance on Saturday the 13th. That's next year. So stay tuned to our website for details on that. We haven't really worked out all uh, what we're going to do with him here as far as the master class and workshop. But as, as I said, stay tuned for information on that later in the year. We'll hope to see you here for that. Up next, contestant number three. The breakdown we'll be hearing is Mississippi Sawyer. Two number two, The Waltz, Streets of Laredo, and the tune of choice, the third and final song, Who's Gonna Talk to Dinah? Please welcome contestant number three.
just heard. Contestant four has made their way to the stage. We'll be hearing the following tunes. The first song is a breakdown entitled Fort Smith. The second tune, a waltz, Maggie West. And the third song, the tune of choice, entitled Katie Hill. Please a nice round of applause for contestant number four.
the stage here momentarily. As a reminder, we've got seven contestants, uh, so if you're keeping score for your people's favorite, uh, take some notes and uh, keep track of who you like, buy a ticket and stick it in the cup. Contestant number five uh, will be playing the following songs. The Breakdown is entitled Fort Smith. The Waltz is called Blackberry Waltz, and the tune of choice, Lonesome Polly Ann. So please, a nice round of applause for contestant number five.
first song is a breakdown. It's called Robinson County. The waltz, peekaboo waltz, and the tune of choice. The third song, Say Old Man, Can You Play the Fiddle? Please welcome to the stage contestant number six.
made their way to the stage, we'll be hearing the following tunes. The breakdown, Rigged Hornpipe, the waltz is called the Missouri Waltz, and the tune of choice, Waynesboro Reel. Please welcome contestant number seven.
Once again, I uh, just want to thank Judy Kent and everybody at Old Time Those Art Traditions for their help today. Uh, if there's anybody that makes my job easier here for one of these events, nobody does it better than Judy. So thank you very much. Really mean that. Okay. All right. Uh, I'm going to get my class. All right. Third place, $100 check and a wonderful one-of-a-kind certificate goes to Tim Treywick. Second place, $300, and a certificate goes to Oakley Smith. First place, $500, and a wonderful Perry Munn pottery plate. Our winner this year, the Open Old Time Division, goes to Everett Elam. Okay, speech when you shake it. We can do this. Um, it's, it's a day of cliches, I guess. Um, I need to thank every single one of you from, from Mountain View. The, you know, I, I came here as a classical violinist. I had no wrist whatsoever. I, I did everything like this. And you guys have, all of you, except for Emily, but all the rest of you have welcomed me into this place and showed me what making real music is, and the food's really good too. But I just, thank you all so much. This this music, and especially old time, you, you can't play strutting around like a peacock. I think old time is a music of giving, and it's a music where we all have to just you know jam along with each other, and that that's how you learn it. If you're if you're wondering if you're thinking of picking, picking up the fiddle and you want to do it, you know do it graciously and do it with an open heart. And uh, I'm going to stop now. <laughs> thank you guys. Congratulations, everybody. Uh, feel free to be on and visit for about another 30 minutes, and we'll clear the auditorium right around 4:30. Have a great day. We'll see you soon.